I was a college athlete. I played American football and I just had an adult and I was a uh, contractor, you know, a construction worker most of my life. And I always had back issues. But in 2012, I was doing fencing on Thanksgiving and sat down for Thanksgiving dinner and ate dinner and couldn't get out of my chair afterwards. So my back had progressed to the point where I needed to do something and actually change careers. Um, that was about 50 years old at the time. And so we decided to go to the doctor and start the medical process of going through um, getting treatment for my back issues. And after a year of physical therapy and um, steroid shots and um, different things, we got to the point where um, he was, they wanted to do a fusion surgery and do a fusion in my L4, L5, and S1. So, and my dad was on a board with a, a medical doctor at the time, and he told him, try to avoid surgery at all costs, because after five years after surgery, you're going to have more issues from the surgery you did than you, you're having now. Everyone with chronic pain knows the pain levels of the scale of one to 10 Where's your pain? And my pain you typically was between a level three to a, a level eight daily. And that varies. And people with chronic pain understand that. I've been on a, a daily regiment of opioid painkillers for over 10 years and um, taking Ambien at night to sleep for a few hours. And then I'm up in the middle of the night because I wake up in pain. And then I start my daily routine of pain meds. So in the, my, uh, surgeon told me that I'd probably never get off the pain meds. I'd be on them for the rest of my life. My wife is a pediatric nurse and she has been for over 30 years and she loves the science and the research side of treatments. And we have been looking at different treatments for years and stem cells is something that we zeroed in on as something that is either the uh, treatment of the future or the present day or something that could really help just arriving at STEM the first day, you could tell that you are in a place of just a quality minded place that really took care of their clients, went over above and beyond. I'm doing the two week um, accelerated treatment plan. After being at the clinic for four days, all of a sudden my pain was gone. And I was thinking, was this the placebo effect? Am I making this up in my head? I mean, how can it having pain for over 10 years, you know, be there present 24 hours a day, all of a sudden be gone after only four days of treatment. And I went out to test it because I thought it was the placebo. I was having a placebo effect. And I went out golfing here in town, in, in Cabo, and I golfed nine holes and had no pain. And I went two days later, I went out and golfed 18 holes. And I remember standing on the 18th tee after going out and like, this, this can't be real. I have to go out and test it again and just see if this is real to try to create the pain again. And I was on, standing on the 18th tee and, and almost in tears, honestly, um, about to tee off. And I texted my cousin and said, you know, I'm standing on the 18th tee. And this is the first time in my life that I can remember, honestly, that I am golfing with no pain. Um, just, it's like, I have my life back. I feel 10 years younger. I've been pain-free now for two and a half weeks. I mean, 100% gone. Haven't had it for a minute. And it's, it's amazing. Anyone that is thinking of having, that has a chronic pain issue and that's thinking of, or, you know, being suggested to go down the surgery road. I so highly recommend, um, trying stem cell therapy first and stem aid definitely has the quality stem cells that you'd be looking for. What a wonderful, you know, beyond expectation experience I've had at STEM aid.